Welcome back guys to Final Fantasy Crystal Bearers. Now in the last episode, a whole bunch of stuff went on that uh, I still can't wrap my head around. So we find out that Jagron <coughs> is a crystal bearer and he crystallized a whole bunch of Selkie guilds and uh, Selkie people including Vigali, which just was ridiculous. But no matter. That's fine. Um, I think we may need to make our way through the vineyard. And, oh yeah. And clean Vigali. And so. And apparently, Belle had some evidence of Vigali's actions. So, her and Kais are going to go over and tell the princess of it. And we are heading over to meet a meet Italian at the ruins. So, we can see the resurrection through. So yeah. Are oh, you here to pick guards? Sorry. Nope, sorry. I have more important business to attend to. We'll just take the lights or not. Oh, this brings back so much man. Remember this is where we chased a meat Italian for the first time? Good times. Ah, it looks like it looks like the vineyard is all happy and whatnot, so. We need to make our way over to the ruins, which, if I recall, is right through this forest and up and around. Oops. Forgotten forest, winery. So we got more forgotten forest right here. And eventually, at the end of this forest, we will run into the ruins. I, I probably said ruins about five times in this past minute. get some stuff here. Ow. You know, the money is nice, but I'd rather prefer the relics, to be honest. Oh, a shop. That sells the same old items. Well, I appreciate it, but... Wow, hello. What are you guys doing? Oops, excuse me. Oh, no. I didn't. Maybe this was where we went the first time. Uh, I feel so stupid. Unless I just went in the wrong direction. I might have. Yep, there it is. Hollow. The warp point. Welcome to the edge of oblivion again. What? I 
Okay. Winery, Wet Highlands, Red Leaf Station, Harvest Pride, Fountain Park, Duke Sky City, Cousin Sands, Commoner's Graveyard, no, Snowfields, Moogle Wood Station, Alright, let's just go back to the okay, forgotten Okay, guys, so if it wasn't apparent, I got lost. And so I had to look up how to get back to the subterranean ruins. But we're here now, so let's continue. I guess I can't take the chocobo with me. Oh well. You would be an Italian. Okay. Seems going down. Whoa. There's the crystal. Dare drop it. These chambers are really creepy. That's not right. Hello, meat Italian. What's going on? I thought you'd be waiting. I wanted us to see the resurrection together. The second resurrection. I told you before. The spell targeting the Lilty Crystal. If that problem isn't resolved, you can help me out. That issue will get I thought I had your understanding on the matter. It is true. That final spell cast by the Yukes was meant to destroy the Lilty Crystal. However, we cannot be certain how that spell will react to the resurrection. That's pretty irresponsible. The resurrection is warranted by the Crystal Principle. The Principle is what made me a Crystal Bearer. The resurrection is an extra. Therefore, the fate of the Lilty Crystal, the fate of the Lilty Tribe, will be determined by the Crystal Principle. It is possible that nothing will happen, or perhaps the Lilty will be erased from this world. I don't like it. You're just using the Crystal Principle to justify your actions. Are you saying bearers are born of principle, so they can do whatever they like? That is just semantics, Lair. All I am trying to do is save my people, save my family. That is all I want. I hope you are not so cruel as to call me melodramatic. I can appreciate your stance, but Altea's concerns are just as legitimate. Do not worry. I have taken some measures to... <gasps> what? <gasps> oh, jeez! Yeah, I know. Like, you owe me one. 
to eliminate you, but no matter. A pariah like you could be easily disposed of. I knew that you would come here. Did you really think I would leave this site unguarded? Begin administrative punishment. What are you doing? Punish the criminal! It is you who must be punished, Dugrand. Hmm. Surely you jest. Mm. Hi, Commander Dugrand. You are a crystal bearer, are you not? Supposing that I am, would that be a crime? No. But you must appear before an inquiry held by the Elder Council in regards to the incidents at the aerial prison aboard the Alexis and various other incidents we believe you to be involved with. You have much to answer for. You do understand what I am saying, don't you, Chagrin? If it was up to me, I would carry out your punishment myself. In any case, do as the princess orders. You'll pay for your crimes. You would call me a criminal? I, who have devoted my life to serving the kingdom a criminal? It was I, it was my power that made this kingdom and its king more prosperous than ever! While you fools are just idling about your daily lives, I am devoting my life to serving the kingdom! How dare you! How dare you call me a criminal! <laughs> Wait, Leo! There are questions that I still need him to answer! Leo, stop it! <laughs> This is Altea. Resurrection hasn't happened. Are you mad? 
What about the Duke's spell targeting the Lilty Crystal? Lael, why are you so intent on helping this Duke? It's not like you. Same reason as you, Kais. I owe Goldenrod. I owe a need to tell you a favor. Same reason? So that Duke was taken out by Jagron too? The resurrection won't succeed without Altea's crystal idol. You're gonna steal the princess's crystal idol? If necessary. What? Mayor! Wait! Mayor! So then, what's your move, princess? Holy mackerel! Well, looks like things have just gotten from bad to worse. I think this is another episode that's gonna have to that's a, that I'm gonna have to call. Um. Wow. Well. I am, I'll be back with more soon. Let's see what happens next. Like I said, we're nearing the end of the game, so. It's only time.